So in this video I'm going to do something a little different. I'm going to take that light and I'm going to make something brand new. This is a um, LED panel along with LED chips. I used three toggle switches and a uh, four foot uh, one by eight by eight. Cut it right down the middle. The sides are I believe two and a half inches wide with a groove that goes all the way around the inside. Unfortunately this little bit was extremely hard to record because it is a four foot board and uh, after having it cut for one day I realized that one of the sides was starting to warp a little bit so I had to um, proceed a lot quicker than I thought and I did not have LED lights those came in the day I was doing this I had to order them out of Amazon so it's cut short from the forefoot so that this small little section here is where the controller box is going to go along with the toggle switch and um, everything needed to power not only the LED chips the panel but the LED strips you saw there are actually going into that groove So the hole here was a little too small in order to do this. I had to drill it out quite a bit. So the best way of doing this with the LEDs is actually to figure out exactly how long you need it and then cut it so that you don't have 16 feet holding you up. This here is, um, this is actually stainless steel that I'm using. Unfortunately, I uh, cut myself pretty good a couple times and had to go out and uh, replace this with aluminum which was quite cheap it was about twenty dollars for two sheets I actually filled the hole in here right here I'm laying out everything on the aluminum I just purchased uh, this is a half inch acrylic that the toggle switches are in initially it was supposed to be one master switch so you could flip the master switch and then go to one of the other ones however that it didn't work out as well as planned so now I have an extra switch in case I want to put anything um, additionally into it I will be using a silver um, thermal paste here that's actually one of two things that I'm actually holding this down with. I'm using UV resin to actually initially hold down the light. There's actually nothing holding the acrylic down. It is um, pretty much wedged in there. There are little extra pieces that I had to cut out. I left the two back pieces open so that you could actually get to the acrylic. So I finished the light. And uh, let me just hook it up for you. Master arm, all 
all the lights on the side. I know this is going to be very bright on the uh, camera. And then you got the middle one. At the very end of this video, I'll show you the dancing LEDs around it. But I haven't had, I don't have that hooked up yet. And on top of everything. I'm thinking about putting this on there, but I'm not entirely sure. And I won't know until I get to um, see it in the dark. Try it in the dark. Uh oh, yet I can't see the thingies here. Here's it. Oh, oh shit. Here's it on. And there's it in the dark. I don't know. I think it throws off a lot of light. There's the middle one. Hopefully the LEDs will uh, work out pretty good too. So, hope you enjoy the LED show and uh, thanks for watching.